Hey y'all, it's Diane with Shell Craft One and my old barn door. And today I am still working in my little flip flop journals that I'm working on. And so I just thought I would turn the camera on and let y'all see what I'm working on and just have a little chat with my friends. So how are y'all today? I hope you're all doing well. We're doing well here, just trucking along. And, um, yeah, so I hope everything is going well for you. I hope you had a great weekend. I worked in the garden all weekend long. <laughs> Y'all look, mom gets these bags from her pharmacy and aren't they just so cute with the little stripes? So I'm going to use this in this journal, I think. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to cover this up. I don't think I'll have to cover this up because I'm going to make it a pocket. So I think what I'm going to do is put it right here. Actually, I think I'm going to put it on this side. And then I'm going to fold this over and make it a pocket right here. And that way it will attach um, the, um, the, the little sack. So let's just, I'm going to go ahead and fold it. I don't think I folded that very straight, did I? <laughs> Let's try that again. Um, but anyways, yes, I worked in the garden all weekend, and I still need to go out there and work some more, but I was trying to give my body a little bit of a break because, oh my goodness, I'm so sore. <laughs> I worked on my beds this weekend, amending them, well, on some of the beds, and oh my goodness, my knees and my back are so sore. <laughs> So I thought, well, I'm, I'm even swelled. I can't wear my rings right now because my, my hands are swelled. So anyways, so I thought I'd give myself a break and just work in the craft room for a little while today. I may go out this afternoon and try to get my peppers planted. We'll see. But I'm going to go ahead and work on this little sack. And I want y'all, uh, I wanted to tell y'all, I know I put them on my community tab, but not everybody sees this. The messages that I put on the community tab. Um, but y'all, my design team has just done some beautiful, beautiful work um, in their projects. I just wish y'all would go over to their videos. If you click on my community tab, you'll see I, there's links to all of their videos. Oh my goodness, they have made some of the cutest stuff with some of my kits and I just hate for y'all to miss them. So I just wanted to bring that up and let y'all know they are over on my community tab. Go click on them, enjoy them. There's some of the cutest little things that they've made. And I think I'm gonna make some of what they've made and put them in these journals. So you'll be able to see that too. But I wanted to show y'all this too. Look, I ordered this on Amazon, y'all because it was a really good price. You know, washi tape is not cheap. And this is, the box is just absolutely stunning. I mean, how cute is that little box? And then it just slides out. I only paid $9.99 for this, y'all. So if y'all want one of these, I'll put a link in the description box below to my Amazon store. And if you get to my Amazon store and you just click on the craft or journal supplies. I, I can't remember how it's titled. It's either craft or journal supplies. But I'll put this in there so you can get to it. But look at all this washi you get. Oh my goodness. Here, let me just show you a couple of them. I'm not going to take a whole long time. I've got it upside down. I'm not going to take a whole long time to do this. But I just thought these were so pretty. I haven't even opened them yet. I mean, I opened the box and looked at them, but I haven't even got to get in here and play with anything in several days because I've been in the garden. And I know, I just want to tell y'all, I know I've put a lot of garden videos up on this channel, um, but it's just because I want to share them on this channel too. I've made a playlist um, for Farmstead Dream. That's my other channel. And I'm just kind of sharing them just, you know, because I'm not getting to do... Uh, Oh, goodness. Oh, it might help if I untape it. I haven't got to do a whole lot of videos for um, this channel just simply because I have been working so much in the garden and trying to um, 
Oh, y'all, look. It's got a backing. Ooh, I like that even better. It has a backing on it. So you can cut off a piece at a time and then just take the backing off. Oh, these are fun. I love these so much. Um, but anyways, so that's why I'm putting those videos on this channel. I just wanted to share them with this channel. And, you know, it gives y'all something to look at, even though it's not a journal video. Um, but you still get to see me, and I get to chit-chat with my friends. So, yes, isn't that pretty? Look how gorgeous that is. And there's, I mean, so much different designs on here. Okay, let's roll this one up and look at another one real quick. I'm only going to pull a couple of these out so y'all don't have to... This is not a, a haul video. <laughs> but anyway, I'm just sharing with my friends. These are so fun. I love those. Okay, so you get four of the wide ones. You get some of these little skinny ones, which are perfect for like doing tip-ins and stuff. Um, let's look at some of these little, little ones over here. If I can get it out. Okay, let's see. Just trying to find the end of it here. I don't see a piece of tape on the end of this one, so let's see how this works. There we go. Okay, now this is actually sticky washi. So it's a variety. I love that. Oh, how pretty is that? Can y'all see that? Okay, oh, I didn't mean to stick it right up in your face, but that's gorgeous. Okay, so there's that one. This is so pretty. I'm excited about this. <laughs> I never buy washi, y'all, because it is so expensive. And I haven't bought any in forever. And I thought about making some to sell in my shop, you know, designing some. What do y'all think about that? Would y'all be interested in that if I designed some and put it in my shop? Okay, I can't get that one open, but you can just kind of see it this way. And then this one is like old ads vintage ads let's see this one this flowers on i don't i can't tell if that's it looks like just old ledgers and receipts and stuff so i like this size i really like these butterflies how pretty are those with the butterflies and the flowers that's pretty so anyways these are uh i'll put these in my shop so that you can grab them if you like them I love them. I think they're super pretty. So I'll probably be using some of these um, in my journals. Okay, and then one other thing I wanted to show y'all. I'm sorry about my messy desk, y'all. Some people complain if I do a video and have a messy desk, but I can't help it. This is how I work. Um, but I wanted to show you one more thing. I got this in the mail. This is from the United States Post Office, and it's an advertisement of all of their postal stamps and things like that look at the sizes of these how fun are these i love this one right here and so these are super fun to go through and cut them out and use them in your journal so if you get one of these little magazines don't throw it away because i almost threw this away till i kind of started flipping through it and realized that it had some look at the horses I mean, those are super cool. And look, you could make a belly band. Let's do that. Let's make a belly band. Oh, no. <laughs> do I want to mess this up, though? Because it's got the barn and the spinning wheel, the weaving, whatever that's called. Spinning wheel, I guess is what you'd call it. Oh, I'll have to think about that. <laughs> but anyways, these are new ones for spring. Betty Ford. Oh, I love the Ansel. Oh my goodness, I love the Ansel Adams. So anyways, these are super fun to just cut, you know, your little pieces out of. And then you can throw away. Look at that pretty hummingbird. Ooh, I know what I'm going to use that page for. Um, my best friend, um, she wants a hummingbird journal um, to commemorate um, her memories of her mama. And so I'm going to make her a hummingbird journal. And those will go in that. Oh, I like these with the berries and the fruits. Oh, and the sunflower one. So anyways, just wanted to show y'all that real quick. If you get one of these, go flip through it and see, if, you know, if there's any stamps or anything in there you'd like to, to cut out before you throw it away. So there's that. All right, let's get started on this. And I need some something to put here to cover cover this over 
just grab my little scrap tray here and let's see. That would be pretty and you could actually make this a double pocket. But I want some color on it. Let's see. Ooh, I kind of like that up against there. Or we could do some... Nope, don't like that up there. Look how pretty that is. That would be pretty. Mm -hmm. Let's see. What else do we have in this little scrap box here? I got quite a few scraps in here. Nope, I think I like this. I just like that. I think that's cute. Okay, that's what we're going to use. We're not going to make this a whole long video, and I'm not going to take 10 years to make a decision now. Do I want that here or here? Maybe I want that here. Okay, maybe I want that here, and we can do this here. Okay, that's what we're going to do. Okay, where is... Ooh, sorry, guys. I do have a mess over here. Here's my glue page, my glue stick. So, um, I have been planting, planting, planting in my, in my garden. Sorry, I am uh, deep in thought right now, I guess. <laughs> Actually, I'm kind of tired today. I don't feel real great today. That's another reason I decided that I'm just going to um, work in the craft room because I don't feel um, super duper good. And so I thought it might be um, a way my body's telling me that um, I need to take a break. So, And I want to get these... Uh, these journals finished because I've got people asking for them. I've had several people contact me and, and want a journal, so I gotta get myself busy and get some done so people can get them. All right, let's see. I am going to fold this here. I don't want a super big pocket right here, so we'll just do that. And then we'll fold him right here and do that, and he'll fit right here. I guess I better put the top on my glue. Oh gosh, this might be stuck together because I haven't been in here in several days to use it. You know, and if you don't use it, it does tend to kind of stick together. So, did I tell y'all? I can't remember if, what I've told y'all, but uh, I guess it's been a couple of weeks ago. We got mom on hospice, and it's not, you know, like her last days or anything. It's just they went ahead and put her on hospice because they couldn't do the palliative care because palliative, uh, blah, blah, <laughs> if I can talk today, palliative care is for someone who wants to have curative measures taken and mom's disease there is no cure and she doesn't want curative measures she she has a dnr you know so they went ahead and put her on hospice and i kind of feel like i've told y'all this already so if i have i apologize that's kind of pretty isn't it i like this green but i don't know if i like it on this color i'm just going to Nope, I don't like that. And I'm not going to waste my time trying to do that. Hmm. Nope, don't like that either. I was trying to put something. Oh, you know what? I've got, um, where is my little basket of goodies from the kit? See if we've got something in here that we could decorate with. I did not do any fussy cuts out of this kit. And now I'm kind of wishing that I did. However, I think I might have some fussy cuts from my little firm. Hang on, let me look. 
I don't have any of my fussy cuts from that kit, but I found these and I think this will be cute on here. So we're just going to use this. I feel like I was telling y'all something and now I forgot what it was. Do y'all hear that little bird out there? He is just a happy little thing this morning. I don't know if y'all can hear him. <laughs> But it is a very pretty day outside today. And I'm hoping to feel like getting out there in the garden today if I can. But if I don't, it's okay. Ooh, I shouldn't have put any glue up at the top. Let me see. Because he's going to be poking over the top of that pocket. I'm probably about making a mess. My goodness. Okay, let's try that. Hopefully that won't stick him down on there. But I think that's a pretty little pocket. What do y'all think? Oh, I better put this back in my glue or Earl, I will forget it. Oh, you know what? I need that because I need to. No, I don't. Well, I do, but um, I think I need to do this side. No, I already did this side. What do I want to do with this side? Because I want to do something. I don't know yet. So um, since I don't know yet, we're going to go ahead and attach this to the page. And I can come back later and do some um, additions to that. Let's see. Okay, so we're going to glue him right here like this. So I'm just going to glue on each side here. Oops. Oh, I think my little bird heard me because he quit. He quit chattering, but I enjoy hearing the birds. Okay, let's see. There we go. Okay, give that just a second to dry. Okay, it's dry, and this didn't stick, so we're good to go on that. And then I thought I would make a little tag or something. Um, I have these... Um, they're just avocado dyed, and I thought that I would make like a, a card to go in the pocket here, but I just want to add a little something. I don't want to add a whole lot because I, I love the simplicity of just leaving it plain with the avocado dyed um, color on there, and how pretty is that? So I think what I'm going to do is maybe just put one of my tabs from the kit, and I haven't decided, do I want to use... One of these. What do I have over here? Ooh, that one's pretty. And this one's pretty too. Or do I want one of these? I kind of like, I kind of like that. We're going to go with that because I already like it. <laughs> so I'm going to just put a little glue on him. And then we'll put him on here. Like so. Hopefully I got it in the middle. I'm kind of eyeballing it here. There. We're going for it. <laughs> okay, and then I thought I would put something pretty just kind of down in the corner or something. And so, <clears throat> let me move this for a second. I have my little tickets. That one's kind of cute, and it would go with uh, 
with the the colors in the bag. Oh, let's see. Okay, we're gonna use these for the smaller pocket. Let's just pull a few out. Oh. Oh, now see, this would be cute to put on here as like a little pocket. I think we will. Let's do that. We should make us a little pocket on here and then you can write on the back of it. So we're going to just glue around the edge. My little bird came back. <laughs> he is happy. What do you call it? A happy little lark? He's a happy little lark. I wonder if he is a lark. Okay, let's see. We're going to put him kind of in center at the very bottom. There we go. And then we'll tuck some pretty things in. Like this. Let's see. Ooh, that's pretty. Put one with the butterfly. Okay, so then you have that, and you can write on the back side. All right, let's um, bring our book back over. If I don't get all these things put back in here, I will lose them. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, we'll bring our journal back over, and we're just going to tuck him in there. Ooh, I like the way that looks. And then we need something to tuck in our little pocket here. Okay, let's see. We have some of these little tags. That would be cute. And we can put a ticket in there since I like the way it goes with, with that. And let's see, what else do we have? Oh, we got some stamps. Let's do... Let's do a little butterfly stamp. Maybe I'll put this here. <laughs> Y'all bear with me. Okay, we'll put the little butterfly stamp in there. Yeah, I like that. Okay. Super cute. One page done. Two pages done. Your secret journaling spot. I don't know what I'm going to put in the envelope yet, so... Um, moving on along. Let's see, how long have we been on here? Oh, yeah, I've been on here a minute. Okay, I wanted to show y'all something else real quick. Let me move this. Okay, so this is um, one of the envelope pockets that comes in the Butterfly Farms kits. And my precious friend, Laura, she's over at Laughing Dogs Book Nook. I will try to remember to put a link to her um, channel in the description box below so you can go find her video she made a little notebook out of this this envelope and it was the stinking cutest little thing you've ever seen so I'm going to make one too but I don't know that I'm going to make it on camera because she's already done it but I just want you to go over there and look at look at what she made um, not only in that video she didn't only make um, the little notebook but she made some beautiful tags and some gorgeous pieces I, I absolutely love her style she's so classy her style just exudes class and i think you'll love it so y'all run over there and check out that video and then um on friday my friend v she's uh, one of my design team members as well laura's one uh, one and v is one um and um, she did like a little ephemera holder. Oh, it was such a cute little thing. So y'all go over and check that out too. Um, like I say, I've got links to all the videos in my community tab. So y'all go check those out. And I hope you enjoy them. But anyways, you definitely have to see this because I'm getting ready to make one myself. But again, I'm not going to do it on video because Laura's already, Laura has already showed you how to do it. So anyways, I think we'll end the video here for now. And um, y'all will probably be seeing some more garden videos because I am doing um, more garden as I'm out working in the garden and trying to get it established for the year. You know, I'm making videos and things like that. So I'll add them to this channel too, just so y'all can um, see those. Um, go over, if you wouldn't mind, would you go over and um, like and subscribe um, to my Farmstead Dream channel? 
the link for that is in the description box below and that would just help me out a whole lot and if you would give this video a like leave me a comment um, and subscribe if you're not a subscriber that would help this channel out too um, because I am struggling right now for my videos to be seen and I think it's because you know there's not been much activity on my channel so anyways if y'all have the time and um, the kindness in your heart would you help a sister out so anyways I hope y'all have a beautiful wonderful day I hope you have a beautiful wonderful week and I will see you in the next video big hugs